Hello and welcome to a new video. Today I'm going to be doing a Euro 2020 that's happening in 2021 kind of prediction. Let's just get into it. We'll go group by group. Group A. Obviously, Italy. That's a pretty, pretty simple, self-explanatory. Italy are Italy. And with this group of Switzerland, Turkey and Wales. Mind went blank for a second there. Hmm. It's between, I, I think Turkey are going to finish bottom. We'll go Wales. We're going we're to go with the home, home nations. Belgium top in Group B. I think their attack, sublime. Uh, their attack, sublime. Lukaku, Hazard, or oh. Could be beautiful, it could be beautiful. Now, Russia, Denmark, Finland. I ain't gonna lie to you. I don't know much about any of these teams. Denmark, Casper Michael. Just because of Casper Michael, they can go second. Now, the thing with this Euros is some third third teams get through. So actually predicting who's third is quite important. So we're gonna go I'm gonna go Russia. They seem to have more footballing pedigree. I'm not gonna lie, North Macedonia, I doubt they'll win again. Netherlands top, Ukraine, Austria. Now into England's group. I'm not gonna lie. Wait, Czech Republic are going to finish bottom, Scotland third. Now, that first game of England versus Croatia will decide who tops this group, I think. Because I think England will beat Scotland, Czech Republic. I think Croatia will beat Scotland and the Czech Republic. If then, if, it's, if this first game is a draw, then it'll go down, I think it'll go down to goal difference. I think that's how it works. So, I think we, we could be in a thing where in the final final game England and Croatia could just be going all out to try and see if see how many goals they could score. But England being England, I'm going to put a second. I'm going to be a little bit pessimistic on that one. I'm going to be a little bit pessimistic. This one, Spain top. They'll finish bottom. I'm gonna put. I'm gonna do that. Because if I'm not mistaken, Lewandowski plays for Poland. Oh, now the group of death. I think, just off like face value, without looking at any of this, France are one of the favourites. I doubt they'll get a point. But, it could be quite an interesting scenario where all the teams beat Hungary and the rest of the games finish as a draw. So they finish with zero points, all the rest finish with two points. No, five. I'm going to put... Okay. That's what I'm going to go with. Because Germany is Germany, they always turn up. Always. Always turn up at a tournament. And you've got Werner, you've got Havertz. Oh, it could get naughty, it could get naughty. Four, and this goes on who's got the most points. So you've got to, you've got to look at the groups and think. Who out of these teams are actually going to... Well... Scotland... Scotland in our group... Well, England's group... Three... Three points? Is three points going to be enough? Well... I, de I definitely think Portugal... 
We'll, we'll go with that. We'll, we'll go with that. Right, now we go into, like, actual knockout games. Who do I think? Oh, that's a cracking game, to be fair. Belgium, Portugal. Oh. Ronaldo. Felix. Bruno Fernandes. I think, I think they'll... Belgium's defence has never been top-notch. It's never been top-notch. So I don't... Italy... France... Spain... Germany, Netherlands... Wales. This'll be a cracking game. I think the Reds are very self-explanatory. That'll be... The, that and the England game will be... Game of the tournaments. Get gay game of the rounds, sorry. I, I do think on our day we can beat Poland. Right, these are some good games. Oh, all these games are actually very good games. Portugal. Already mentioned. Italy, very nice young side. Very nice young side going. With a little bit of experience. Which is kind of what you want. You want the youth. That kind of energy. With the level headedness of the kind of the 38 year olds. But I just think. I just think Portugal. They've got that little, that little something. France. France versus England. It's a one-off game. It's a one-off game. And it's a bit like it's a bit like the FA Cup when someone like on the older shot playing Manchester United. There's always that if. What if? But I, I, I do think France, they've got a little bit too much for us. A little bit too much for us. Germany versus Spain. Spain have come off the boil a little bit. They went through that run of just winning absolutely everything. The Euros, the World Cup, they were dominating club football with Real Madrid, Barcelona, Atletico, they were dominating the thing. Spain, footballing nation, kind of come off it a little bit. So I do have to go with Germany there. Netherlands versus Wales. I'm going to go with Wales on that one. I'm going to go with Wales. Just for that home nation representation in the semi-finals. And France, France coming from the group of death, get through Russia, and got a good game against England, good game against Portugal. Let's be honest here, Germany will beat Wales. And Germany as well, they've got some very good games. France, very good games. England, very good games. The way that this is all set up, it's going to be a good tournament. I think it is going to be an absolutely brilliant tournament. France or Portugal, and we're talking about whoever I put through here comes from the group of death. Those three, all group of death. I think the winner will come from that. I, I do. Before doing all this, I thought group of death got the winner. Portugal, France, Germany. It's it's just gonna happen, isn't it? I'm gonna pick France. Got a nice side, nice blend of. Defence, they've got Mbappe, Kante, it's, yeah, I, I just, for that reason, I think France are going to win it, for that exact reason, I think if you've got a blend of, they can defend when necessary, if they're 1-0 up going into the 80th minute, they can defend, if they're 1-0 down going into the 80th minute, they, they've got it, they've got it all, they've got it all, anyway, after my prediction, I'll leave the link to this in, in the description. Tell me what you thought. Did you think I did right? Did you think I did 
think I did wrong. Who's your dark horse? Who do you think? Who do you think is going to win it? Because, yeah, I think France are going to win it. Who do you think is going to win it? See ya.